blank will be the best time of your life. Now, I'm sure we've heard this saying before, like high school will be the best time of your life, college will be the best time of your life, working will be the best time of your life, death will be the best time of your life. Like, all of this is a bunch of nonsense, to be honest, because everything past our childhood becomes a lot harder and a lot more irritating, so how could it possibly be the best time of our lives? And because people ask this stupid question, we have to sit down and think, what well, really was the best time of my life? And it's probably because of their shitty situations and because they got nostalgia vision, they look back on their own history and they're like, yeah, th that was definitely the best time of my life. When in fact, it was probably quite awful, but they just want to remember it as really good. And it always seems to happen, like, the further back we go, the better things get. And that's for a reason. Because... The best time of our lives, in all honesty, is when we're between zero and one year old. I say this because we literally don't have to do anything. You just eat, you poo, you pee, you learn to make noise. You don't even have the dexterity to play with toys, so no one even forces you to do that. Like literally, all you have to do is just exist and grow. You can't even comprehend sound into language, only you know it just sounds familiar or not so they're not even forced to learn it. They just pick it up whenever they feel like it. Their only job, like I said, is just to exist. And then, you know, to leech off their parents for the next 20-ish eh, years as they grow up. But let's, well, let's think short-term-wise, like, why is being a baby so good? Well, literally, the only thing you have to do is just cry, and everything comes to you. My shit myself? Eh, better cry. I want to be picked up? Hm, better cry. I want to sleep? Cry. I had too much sleep. Cry. I want food. Cry. I want that dangerous thing that will straight up fuck me up. Hey, hey, wait. Where are you taking it? <laughs> and also, it's not our job to dress ourselves up as babies. If we dress stupid, well, it's clearly the parents or the grandparents' fault. And finally, someone else is getting ridiculed for how stupid I look instead of myself. Also, dying doesn't seem to be my fault either. You know, if I catch a disease, or if I do something I'm not supposed to, well, it's not my responsibility to take care of my own well-being. It's of, you know, my parents. In fact, nothing seems to be my fault at all. Like, if I was just sitting on the couch after a meal, and I puked everywhere, people would just be like, no, look at that cute little bundle of joy. He's growing up and his body's working so well. But if I was to do that nowadays, people would be like, Bro, what the fuck? Are you serious? Plus, also, if you really think about it, adults say, Oh, it's so great, I have so much money, I can go on all these vacations to these great places, and I can see these astounding sights I've never seen before. But, uh, they forget. As babies, we don't have any reference material to be like, Okay, I've seen that before, because we are just coming into the world a blank slate. We know nothing. Everything we see amazes us, like, holy shit, that's a cup, but I can see through it. What? Is that a ball? Oh my god, it squeaks. Like, being a baby is so much more interesting. Everything is new to you. You don't understand any of it, but you're loving all of it. But as an adult, we're like, we know how shit works and we can be cynical about it. Because if you're poor, when you're an adult, that sucks. But when you're poor as a baby, you don't care. As long as you just get something to play with, everything's hunky-dory. So being a baby is definitely the best time of your life. And if you disagree, well, then you can cry about it. High school will be the best time of your life. College will be the best time of your life. <clears throat> will be the best time of your life.